Happy first week of school to a lot of our Omaha Metro school districts. And in my neighborhood, it's Elkhorn's first day. I'm Jill Lampkin standing on the corner of 207th and Glen, where cars are just beginning to line up for the after school pickup. But construction nearby has parents saying it's more congested than usual. Amanda Hansen, like many parents, is eager to get her kids back to school. But with a daughter in seventh grade, driving her and her other siblings to and fro can be time consuming. I mean, it was blocks and blocks of cars having to go through the residential area which it's an older residential area. There's not a lot of sidewalks, so there was a lot more traffic and it was kind of dangerous. For the first time in a week and a half, she realized she'll have to arrive 10 minutes early because of construction on Elkhorn Drive, the route she typically would take. It doesn't seem like a lot, but I just it just doesn't seem safe with all the cars funneling through the neighborhood when there's that access road that's not being used. Construction on Elkhorn Drive started July 31st closing the road from West Maple to Emmett Street for sewer insulation. The city tells me the work being done is for the nearby apartment complex. The worst part I think that gets me is that a lot of the displaced people from the tornadoes are living in those apartments that are right there. And I don't know how they're getting anywhere conveniently. While the construction is less than half a mile of road, parents like Amanda argue that it's blocking an essential exit onto West Maple meaning all traffic will have to weave through the nearby neighborhood or exit on 204th to get out of the area. We're just going to have to plan, leave earlier, figure it out. Omaha Public Works says construction will go until next week. On Elkhorn Drive, I'm Jill Lampkins, your Elkhorn reporter.